What is up guys? I'm starting the vlogs today. I got Phil with me and Jonathan in the back seat. What are we doing today, Phil? All right guys, we are in route right now to PA, an hour and a half drive. We're gonna pick up uh, Crown Vic. Jonathan's buying another Panther. Crown Vic because you guys know the Grand Marquis an engine win. He can tell you the details right now about it. Uh, so apparently it's supposed to be a detective car. So it's got the, I want to say the LSD. It's already got dual exhaust. You already know it's going to get straight pipe. So the guy wants 2500 cash, but we're going to try to drop that down a little bit. That's it. All right, guys, me and Zahil are in the car waiting. He is now talking to the guy about this Crown Vic. It's crazy is because the Crown Vic that he's buying is basically the same exact one that I had as my first Crown Vic. Well, my only Crown Vic, I should say. Silver police interceptor, cloth bench seats. Um, I had the police interceptor wheels though, with the, the Steelys with the silver caps and tint. So, I don't know. He just came back from a test drive. What do you think? He gonna get it? For sure. He likes it, I already know he likes it. We'll see you guys. Hopefully he can get that price then, we'll see talking right now all right guys John got the crown Vic for twenty four hundred dollars saved a hundred bucks hey you know uh, he's calling his insurance company right now just to put it on the insurance just in case because it's not in his name yet the plates that are on the car are my old plates so we're trying to if we do get pulled over we're trying to limit the amount of tickets and stuff that might happen hopefully we, hopefully we don't get pulled over we're not doing anything dumb. Um, so once he's done that, though, we're gonna go get some food at PJ Willihan's, and then uh, go. He seems pissed about something. I guess the insurance ain't working. Oh well. Goodbye. Hey, uh, sweetheart. Think it's goodbye. It's not really goodbye. All right. This guy. He looking yeah. at food spots right now. I'm just saying. There's a lot of. There's a lot he of said, options for us. He said, my ass hungry. Get some food. <laughs> he said, hurry up, John. This guy is pissed. He just got on a phone call with the person and they hung up on him. Policy changing. I can get you to someone who can help you with policy changes. Please save or enter the policy number you're calling about. <laughs> All right. So yeah. So I got a hundred in my pocket still. You treating out, huh? We celebrate um, on you, right? So what? So we're gonna celebrate on you. <laughs> now look, it does have. Well, it's not. It's not really too many problems, but the lights on the dash, they're dim. That's easy to switch. Uh, the only problem I have is there's a little. Um, little thrust on it on the on the left back fender don't worry about that your it, right fender was your right fender was messed up on the grand marquee anyway yeah i'm not really i'm not really too worried about that but the, the front bumper is fucked a little bit on it, the front it is but a junkyard can fix that Jati, that next light, uh, we're making a left. Got done eating at PJ Willihan's. We're about to go show you the Crown Vic. Get some more lighting over here. I'll catch you guys there. I'm gonna show Sharon, cuz what we got. Alright, so. We ain't got shit, let's go. No. <laughs> nah, guys, I mean, this thing's pretty clean. This reminds me of my. My Crown Vic, literally, I had the exact same color and all. I just had the, the I didn't have these hubcaps. I had the silver uh, push covers, but I had tint. But this, it, it's not bad at all. I mean, interior is fucking spotless in this thing. Yeah. Except that carpet. I, I had the same seats and all. Same radio, too. I told him, he, he trying to be like me now, you know? But uh, let me stop talking. You talk. 
All right, so first things first, interior, everything from the Mercury is going in here. Seats, carpet, that's brand new. Those are some nice ass seats. Uh, we got some damage on the bumper. I might end up there getting a, can't even see, let me get the light. I might not end up getting a new bumper, but for now I might just transfer it to Mercury. Mustang wheels is definitely definitely coming on here. Tents definitely. Resonator delete. Rear cat delete. We're well, basically just going to move the straight pipes from the Grand Marquis on here. Yep. We're going to, like you said, tent. Um, Mustang wheels. This time he's going to lower it. Um, lower it in the front. Front and back. 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 All right, just front, he says. Just front. Uh, new headlights we're gonna get. I mean, I can do a headlight rest up on these things. The Marauder side markers are going on here for sure. The chin spoiler, everything, yep. So now we got a uh, hour and 40 minute drive back home. So hopefully nothing happens to either car. He has to get the hood resprayed. The clear is peeling. That's some cheap. Whole car looks nice. Body straight, drive straight. We're gonna see how it is on highway. Well, he said we won. Catch you guys at the house. All right, guys. It's the next day. We just got done at the DMV. We got the title, registration, and plates. We're about to go put that on and then go to inspection. Yeah. What's cool is that there was a snap-on truck here, and he let us go on and check it out because he's never been on one yeah. and I say yo these things are packed to the brim but um he was unloading all of his new equipment so he, he we really couldn't go on too far because there was boxes all over but it's still nice for him to let us uh check it out let him see it um I do have a video of that on my other phone I want to put that on the video right now all right but uh next stop is going to be putting the plates on at his house and then inspection. Yo guys, this cop's been following me for a minute now. Every turn I do, he does. I don't know. Psych. Alright, so we got the plates on. We transferred everything from inside the Grand Marquis to the Crown Vic. We're actually on the way to the Junker right now to go look at some parts like usual. So, Catch you guys there. How's it ride? Rides good. All right, guys, we got you pull it. Let's get it. Sean, why are we always here, man? Hey, man. Flipping cars, buying cars. Young girls, the place to be, man. You know how many parts I got for cars that I was flipping here, man? And that's the thing, guys. If you guys are flipping cars, right? I know this isn't a flipping car episode, but if you guys are flipping cars, go to your nearest junkyard. This one is five minutes, ten, ten minutes from my house. Then we got another one that's what? 40 minutes away, and there's another one that's 30 minutes away. If you guys are flipping cars, check out what's at your junkyard. You know why? Because there's so many cars here that, that you can get parts for. Like, there's all Panther stuff here. Crown Vicks, Grand Marquis, okay. There's so many Chevys at this one. Like Impalas, HHRs, uh, uh, Cobalts. If you guys know what is at your junkyard, then that's gonna help you out by, by selling cars. If you know, that your junkyard has 20 Grand Marquis and Grand Marquis are selling like crazy or, or Crown Vicks, dude, buy them. If you guys have hella Impalas, hella Chevys or, or hella Toyotas or Hondas, start buying that stuff. A lot of people love Toyotas and Hondas. They last fucking forever. Uh, same thing with Chevys, man. Like, and Fords. Like, the, the, I counted about 10... 10 Cobalts. You guys remember the 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 black Pontiac Grand Marquis? Uh, 
Pontiac Grand Marquis. The black Pontiac Grand Am, there's about eight of these here. Ford Rangers, here. Like you always want to get some parts. That's my tip. Because you guys always ask me, where do I find these cars at? Or where do I buy these parts at? Whenever we buy cars, we know what cars to get because our junkyards have them. Then, if we can't find any of the parts that we need here, Amazon, rockauto.com. Cheapest parts you guys can buy. So, while we're here looking for Crown Vic stuff, we're going to be looking at some maximum parts too. I just need an airbag and something else, I think. But, if you guys need rims, rims. If you guys need steely steely. Like, look at this. Pile of steelies, pile of rims. Then you guys got all, all wheels and tires on the cars and shit. Like, look at this Mustang right here. Mustang, so. Red interior. Oh my god, this red is interior. red interior. Red on red. Shit. Carpet. They painted the steering wheel. <laughs> I wouldn't have did all that. Oh my god. But like, look. Mustang. Mustang. I know there's three more. Uh, all Hondas over here. Hondas, Hondas, Hondas. Like, guys. Trust me. Check out your drunk yards. Then that's how you start knowing. You know what? Well... I seen that there was five Honda Civics at my junkyard. The one on Facebook Marketplace needs a bumper. Well, my junkyard has five bumpers. Three might be messed up and two are okay. You know what? Boom, done. You need wheels? Wheels. Like, there's a bunch of Ford Escapes here. Honda Accords. This is like the third one I've seen this generation. Like, let me stop talking about flipping cars. That's another video. We're getting back to them soon, guys. Don't worry about that. Um, we're just going to be chilling at the junkyard now, looking at parts and stuff, though. So, catch you guys later. Inspection is done. No Crown Vic. We're all legal now. Title, plates, registration, insurance, and that inspection. You all good, man. You passed. Yeah, man. Let's get it. Let's yeah, get it. Man. All right, guys. We're back home. Everything's done. About to edit the video right now. You all happy that everything's done? Yeah, I'm tired, man. He tired, but he's trying to switch everything over today. We ain't doing that. That's a different video. So thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Catch you guys next time.